To understand the current state of an area of law, it's often necessary to understand its history. The two most dramatic arcs in the evolution of constitutional law are the growth of the Bill of Rights and the 14th Amendment, and the expansion of the federal government's Interstate Commerce Clause Authority. And a crucial stepping stone in Commerce Clause jurisprudence is the United States Supreme Court's decision in National League of Cities v. Ussery. In 1938, Congress enacted the Fair Labor Standards Act. The act included the first national minimum wage and also required that employees receive time and a half if they worked more than 40 hours in a week. Initially, the act didn't apply to state and local governments. But in 1974, Congress extended the reach of the act to cover state and local government employees. Several states, cities, and intergovernmental organizations, including the National League of Cities, sued the Secretary of Labor, claiming that Congress was without constitutional authority to impose wage restrictions on states and their subdivisions. A three-judge district court panel dismissed the lawsuit. The United States Supreme Court granted the League's appeal. 